as it stands at the moment I'm very critical of Iceland I'm a food snob I'm a brand snob I've shopped there god way over a decade ago and I haven't been impressed with the quality of food I haven't been paid to do this video I've just been provided with 50 pounds of vouchers to do a haul am I gonna be an Iceland convert I don't know we'll see so I went a bit mad didn't I and I actually spent double the amount of vouchers that I was given and that's purely because there was so much choice and I'm seriously sitting here thinking oh my god you were so wrong and I'm kind of embarrassed and um, it's you know it's it's surprising I'm so glad they're moving away from the prawn ring and they've got quality luxury seafood in like king prawns huge scallops got monkfish and lobster tails real monkfish and lobster tails cod fillets 100% beef burgers and there's loads of veg as well which obviously when it's frozen it keeps all its nutrients in and it's so good for you because I love a lot of fresh food and we cook lo with lots of fresh food as a family but the only problem is sometimes we don't use it all up in time and we it ends up going off before we have a chance to use it so when it's frozen it kind of makes a lot more sense financially as a family because we get to eat all that fresh nutrient rich food that when it's in the freezer we just pull it out when we need it so in that way we're saving a lot of money they've got a lot of iceland owned stuff but they've also got big brands in there so i've got some tetley green tea i've got yorkshire tea tea bags which are my favorite I mean, we even picked up some luxury brioche buns for crying out loud. I, I mean, I wouldn't think of Iceland and think brioche, definitely not. <laughs> There's a great deli section as well. So we picked up some chili olives, some cured meats, pastrami, sliced chorizo. For a bit of fun, easy meals, we got straight out of the freezer, into the oven and onto our plate kind of food, lamb koftas. Um, chicken and vegetable kebabs, chicken breasts. If you've had a long day at work and you've got to feed the family or just a long day, let's face it, because parenthood is full of those, and um, you just want to feed the children, make sure they're having a well-balanced meal and they're happy and no nonsense, no messing around, just bung it in the oven and you're done. There's plenty of choice for that kind of thing as well. We picked up some gigantic strawberries as well. I got these patisserie Belgian waffles. So you just grill these from frozen in four minutes. And I got this amazing raspberry and Prosecco semifredo. Anything that's got Prosecco in the title, I'm there. I mean, they've even got sushi packs. Sushi packs. The Sauvignon Blanc, I have to say, is one of the best we've had. My husband's in love with it. He said, can't we go back to Iceland and buy a massive case or two of them and get those delivered? Wine is made from grapes. Isn't that part of your five a day? I also love the delivery service. If you go into your nearest store and you can find that online, you spend over £20 and they deliver to your home. So that's fantastic service. I'd had this big full trolley. I had my baby strapped to my chest in a sling. It's quite stressful, isn't it? I got to the checkout and I was so relieved because they packed it all for me. I said, do you want me to do anything to the cashier? And she went, no, no, it's okay. You just stand there. We'll do it all for you. And then of course it got delivered to my door as well. And it was so easy. Just standing there doing nothing is, is fantastic. Thank you so much. Would I go back? Yes, I would. And I, I am telling you, honestly, I never thought I would say that. So, I slim well done. I take my hat off to you. For even more hauls, recipes, tips and tricks from the rest of the Channel Mum team, pop over to channelmum.com forward slash Frozen Friday and check out Frozen Fridays over on the Channel Mum YouTube channel too.